The mole's expecting. You'll wait your turn in the back. Don't speak unless spoken to. And no funny business. All right? Merely an unfortunate side effect, Madam Mole. I... I don't expect... Unfortunate side effect? Is lot more than unfortunate side effect. Is mud-riddled catastrophe is what is. Everyone in bar sleep. Everyone who drink wine, close eyes and start snore. Not good for business. Well, yes, we put too much of the poppy stem in the mix. I blame the... Don't care. Responsibility on you. You cause disaster, you fix disaster. Poppy stem only to make wine more good, give spice, make more people buy wine. This, this make people not buy wine. This make people sleep and not drink any more wine. Make people buy other wine. This is bad thing, not good thing. Bad, bad thing. So, you fix. How you will fix? Oh, well, see, that's the problem. We've we've run out of poppy stem. It all... it went into that one shipment. Earth, save us from you lot. Without poppy stem, our wine just wine. Nothing extra. No spice. Very well. You get Eden Song from City Green. It grow there. Goat eat it. Goat love it. Goat get dizzy and fall over. Goat never know when enough is enough. Not same as poppy stem even song, but we'll do for now. Make wine more special again. Thank you, madam. I'll... Mix right amount next time. Not too little or no spice and not too big or everyone go sleep. And if everyone sleep, you sleep. You sleep long sleep. Final sleep. Um, oh, right. God, yes, yes, I... Thank you, my lady, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. What are you doing, Azadi? Hmm? Come out of shadow. Let me see you. Maybe she wasn't informed of my visit. Maybe she has no idea I'm with the Resistance and believes that I represent the Azadi. Shepard sent me. I'm... Yes, yes, I know who you work for, Azadi. The Samare, the Resistance. Old stone library with wet floor. Motley group of personality. Ripe with drama. Come on, do not waste my time. I don't have mud for brain. I need to know what you need so I can speak what I need. Is way of thing. Before I do favour, you do favour. This is how the mole work. Never the first, always the second. The resistance is already fighting the Azadi. Doesn't that count as doing you a favour? But you are Azadi. I am. An apostle. I was. <laughs> I'm not like human. Azadi, they are worst of lot. How I know Azadi not playing me? How I know you not playing me? Goddess, save us all. I am Kian Alvani. I was the apostle, but now I'm a rebel. I'm here to make my people leave the Northlands and return to Azadir, and to ensure our so-called leaders stand trial for their crimes. I don't know. Smell like trap. But let us pretend you speak truth. What you want with the mole? I was told you could help us with weapons and supplies. Maybe the mole can help with weapon, maybe she cannot. But before this question answered, you help me with something. Scratch back. Scratch? It's just saying. Not want your oversized hand all over back. 
favour for me. Favour for you in turn. What do you need? Need to intercept runner. Messenger who pass word between guard station and city. There is letter I need. You help Mole do this, Mole will consider your problem. I can do that. Good for you, Apostle no more. One condition. This runner. You will not hurt him. I will not? Why not? They use young men for runners. Boys. They have fought no battles. Killed no rebels or magicals. They don't deserve to die. They are still enemy. I need your promise. I promise, I promise. No one hurt your little runner. My man there will mark place on map where runner pass. From there you find place to take message from runner with no guard watching. Remember, no one must see. Very important this. You take letter from runner, we get letter from you, everyone goes separate way, everyone happy. When job done, talk to the mole again. The mole will be ready to talk business. I wonder what sort of magical this one is. I've heard soldiers returning from the northern forests talk about the mole people who burrow into the mud. What are you? What I am, he asked. What I am? I am the mole. That's not the name of your species. My species, he said. The Azadi, always so tactful, always so sensitive. In my tongue, that name be Panda Panta. It mean tiny folk who sing to earth and shape it, or something like this. This fancy way of saying we live in muck, know many song and dig deep tunnel. So we are mole, deep dweller, digger, mole with fancy name, who speak and sing and also magic. Except a Zardi come and put fire and smoke in Banda Tunnel. And when Banda come out, a Zardi slaughter. Every one of us, man, woman, child, infant, no mole spared except me. Except old woman left me for dead. I am last of species, Azadi. Last of people, last of Banda Banta. Last of Mole. I am the Mole. And now you go and come back only when finished. Go. Shoot. Leave. You know door. Easy to find. Still open. tried to steal my purse. So? You're a Zardi. That's the worst excuse ever for stealing a purse. You could get your arm chopped off. So far, so good. Lucky for you, I'm not a Zardi. Now scram. How tall are you? You're really tall. Leave me alone, boy. You're a lot taller than my dad. Are you sure you're not a Zardi? Yes. You look a Zardi. Are you a soldier? Why aren't you in uniform? Are you secret police? What? No. Run off before I lose my patience with you. 
You sure look like one of them. Oh, for the love of the goddess. What's your name, boy? Bip. Bip? Yeah. So? You should be with your mother, Bip. Not out on your own, thieving. Go home. Can't. I ain't got one. I'm sorry. You should still not... They're not dead or anything. Uh, my parents. They were just sent to Guillen. Guillen. That's where the Magicals are sent. They don't come back from there. But the boy must know this already. He must have seen it happening to others. To the prison colony. Re-education camp. That's what my father said. They probably didn't listen very well in school when they were children. They'll be back when they've been properly re-educated. No one comes back from the islands. Not Magicals. What do you mean? I mean... Are you saying they're going to stay there forever? He's only a boy. But so was I when I became an orphan. No one protected me from the truth. They're not coming back. But why? What will happen to them? You shouldn't think of such things. Do you have no family here? Not in Mercuria. They're all in the Southlands. What's going to happen to them? They will be put to work. That's what the prison camps are for. To keep the Magicals away from humans. To segregate them. Segregate? To keep Magicals apart from humans. Forever. You're lying. I am not. Truly. You're one of them. Why are you here? Are you going to take me and send me to be a segre segregate? Segregated. Two? I'm not one of them. Well, you sure look and sound like them. I'm sorry about your parents. But I have things I need to do. Are you with the Resistance? Uh, resistance? Well, of course not. I'm... Because I overheard someone saying there's an Azadi in the Resistance now. And if you're Azadi, and you're here, and you have things to do, that sounds an awful lot like you're with the Resistance. Keep your voice down, boy. Don't worry. Everyone in Old Town supports the Resistance. Most everyone, anyway. What do you mean by most everyone? I mean that there are some who don't support the Resistance, some who sneak off to National Front Assemblies, some who rat out rebels to the Azadi. Do you know anyone like that? No. Well, I don't know their faces, but I know where there's a National Front Assembly tonight. Show me. What? Show me where. I get to go on a mission with you. That's... that's... so incredibly cool! Calm down, boy. I just want you to tell me where it is. How well do you know the city? Well, not... very. Right. So I'll show you. Too complicated to tell you. It's not safe. For you? No. For me? I leave the ghetto all the time when it's dark. I know where to go. Where the guards are posted, their patrol routes, everything. I'm like a rogue. One with the shadows. The veiled avenger. I'm an assassin. Uh... Just show me the way and then you're coming straight back here. I'll just stay for a little while. Straight back. Or I find someone else to take me. Good luck with that. But fine, I'll come straight back. Are you ready? Can we go now? I should explore first, and maybe do some of my other tasks. Will you wait for me here? Oh, man. But we are going, right? Tonight? Soon. Fine. I'll wait. I've got the non-magical medicines your body needs. Fully authorized and licensed. No sorcery. Always be vigilant, citizens. Thank you. 
a runner passing messages between checkpoints. See, which way is it again? It's so hard to see anything in this light. Right, left, left's right. Uh, um, uh, left. The sign reads, Earthrin's Ascent. It says, Watcher's Court. See, wait, wasn't it left? Not right. Right, don't sound right. But hey, signs never lie. Right it is. <laughs> this don't look right. boy's death. My shift's over. I think. Hey! Who goes there? Must have been the wind. The Azadi return to get proverbial back scratched. 
the mole deceived me. She said the runner would be unharmed, and yet they killed him. I can see no reason for his murder other than vengeance and cruelty. How can I trust someone like that? I can't let this lie pass, or I will appear weak. You lied to me, Mole. Just like Azadi lied to my people. Just like they say, come out, little one. You will not be harmed before they slaughter them all. That boy did no harm to your people. Banda children did not harm your people. If she has something on her mind, I should let her speak. One death cannot compensate for another. This is true, Azadi. Retribution may be counterproductive. But your people must also be made to suffer for their crime. They need to see the consequence of their action. They need to feel pain. And that man, that boy, he was in the wrong place at the wrong time. He's safer this way. He cannot run back and tell on us. Or on you. You talk about making my people suffer. But my people know nothing of what has transpired here in the Northlands. You can't lay this at the feet of all Azadi. How do I make them see? How do I make them understand our loss? The Banda Banta are no more because of Azadi. I can gnash teeth and sharpen claw for many moon. It will not change truth. Your people will never mourn mine. But if I take life, make mother suffer the loss of child, make friend miss friend, Husband, Miss Wife. Maybe then someone will think of mine. Maybe then someone will remember our loss. I'm not sure that's how it works. Perhaps not, Kian of the Azadi. But one can always hope. I may not honour that part of the arrangement, but I will honour most important part. Your resistance will get weapon. All the weapon I have to give. I still need some for my men. Sharpest sword, swiftest axe, strongest bow. But the rest go to your people. Not your people, Azadi. Your people rebel movement, otherwise would be silly. Of course. Thank you. My men will be in touch with your women, and also men. Leave now, Azadi. It's dark and late. And I will sleep. Sleep and dream of happier day in Burrow to the north, where laughter of children fill every tunnel. Dream of friend and of family, while I mourn them all.